Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Paul Pogba. He could be a real game-changer for this team, Peter. He's got the strength to hold off defenders and the technical ability to pick out a killer pass. He can also shoot with great power and accuracy. He's a real midfield dynamo, actually, capable of, of winning a tackle in his own half and then charging downfield to make something happen at the other end. Box to box. I'm thinking the same. He will be a central feature, no doubt. And we're underway. Alex Tellez tries to switch the play. He's pinged one through here. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Oh, sweet feet. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Alex Tellez plays it short. Pogba, he'll have a go. Only partially clear. And a shot! Goal! Manchester United! Manchester United take the lead! The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Manchester United grab an early lead. Good start. Lindelof. Lindelof drives it forward. Greenwood. Van der Beek goes long. Well, he acknowledges. Oh, real danger here. Gets good distance on it. Fred. Manchester United are enjoying a good spell right now and leading. Hoists it forward. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Greenwood! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Played out to the right. Play Shot at goal! Good movement there, but not the best of finishes. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Van der Beek. Forward it goes. Greenwood desperately wants to get on the end of this. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? He's got options out wide. He's had that. Has a go! Oh, 
what a wonderful stop. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Gunalong gets it back. Tries to get it forward quickly. Fred does well to read it and intercepts. Pogba plays it over to the other flank. Manchester United scored early, of course, and the score is 1-0. He's made sure that that won't get through. One bissaka Van der Beek. Had a shot. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Ball's loose, and he's after it. And it's played forward. And it's half-time here. Well, there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Manchester United head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Here we go again then. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Twan Sebe. Van der Beek. Now it's Cavan. It's Cavani! Good first touch and almost as good a second. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Tries to get it forward quickly. One Bissaka. Forward it goes. McTominay. One Bissaka tries to locate someone up front. Hoists it forward. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. And it's played forward. Tries lifting it over. I think that's offside, yes it is. Gets it upfield. Cavani battles to win it back. Up for the header! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. 
And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Gorgeous control there. Whipped in. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. And they've been caught out here. Plays it out to the flank. Now it's Soltado. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. And out to safety. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. He's gone for it. He scores! Two ahead, late in the day. Game over, surely. Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's got to be a change. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honor shift. So that's two now without reply. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Hoists it forward. Leading by two and the finishing line in sight. Gone along. Forward it goes. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. But there's going to be another change here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Twanzebe, Alex Tellez, looks to dink one in, oh well defended, and the finish, that has certainly tested the keeper, well you can't ask for much more than that, a difficult moment he simply had to deal with. And it's been taken short. He's there to receive. Has a hit! And it's there! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. without reply this is becoming a stroll 
Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Shoots! The whistle is gone, and it is all over. Manchester United, winners of a no contest. They just swamped their opponents in superior quality. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Yeah, we knew there was a sizable gap in the quality of both squads, and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. So thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.